in the hushed whispers of ancient sanctuaries, passed down through generations of revered sages, lies a profound wisdom encoded within the very essence of existence itself, the seven laws of Hermes Trismegistus. These sacred principles, studied and venerated by seekers of truth for millennia, form the core of an ancestral text known as the Kybalion, a treasure trove of esoteric knowledge that has captivated and inspired countless souls throughout history. Hermes Trismegistus, the enigmatic, thrice great Hermes, emerges from the mists of time as a legendary figure shrouded in myth and reverence. Said to have walked the earth during the golden age of ancient Egypt, he is portrayed as a sage of unparalleled wisdom, a bridge between the divine realms and the mortal world. His origins are interwoven with the rich tapestry of both Greek and Egyptian cultures, a testament to the cross-pollination of ideas and philosophies that flourished in this ancient cradle of civilization. This unique fusion of intellectual and spiritual traditions laid the groundwork for what would later become known as Hermeticism, an esoteric path that sought to unlock the mysteries of the universe and the human spirit. According to Hermetic teachings, Hermes Trismegistus was not merely a philosopher or scholar, but a conduit for divine revelations. He is believed to have received profound insights directly from the source of all creation, meticulously inscribing these truths into sacred texts that have been passed down through the ages. The Kybalion, often regarded as the cornerstone of Hermetic philosophy, serves as a repository for these timeless teachings, revealing the fundamental principles that govern the universe and guide the human experience. The seven laws contained within the Kybalion offer a roadmap to self-discovery and spiritual enlightenment. They speak of the interconnectedness of all things, the power of the mind, the principle of vibration, the duality of existence, the rhythm of life, the law of cause and effect, and the principle of gender. By delving into these profound truths, Seekers embark on a transformative journey of self-awareness and spiritual growth, unlocking the potential that lies dormant within their souls. The Kybalion, an ancient and revered hermetic text, unveils seven profound laws that illuminate the intricate mysteries of existence and the cosmos. Among these, one law stands out as so potent, so transformative, that even seasoned spiritual practitioners approach it with reverence and caution, careful not to linger too long in its depths. This law, like a double-edged sword, can lead to profound enlightenment or unsettling disorientation if not approached with wisdom and humility. Yet, for those who are prepared to embark on a journey of self-discovery and spiritual awakening, Mastery of these seven laws offers a glimpse into the true nature of reality, a perspective shared only by a select few who have dared to transcend the limitations of ordinary perception. If you are ready to join this elite circle of initiates, then it is time to plunge into the depths of the Kybalion and unlock its hidden treasures. The first hermetic principle, known as the Law of Mentalism, is perhaps the most profound and transformative of the seven laws outlined in the Kybalion. It challenges our conventional understanding of reality by proposing a radical notion that the universe, in all its vastness and complexity, is fundamentally a mental creation. This is not to say that the physical world is an illusion or a figment of our imagination. Rather, the Kybalion suggests that the universe is a manifestation of an all-encompassing, infinite mind, a universal consciousness that permeates and animates everything that exists. This cosmic mind is not separate from us. It is the very essence of our being, the source from which all thoughts, emotions, and experiences arise. To grasp this concept, consider the analogy of a dream. While immersed in a dream, the landscapes, characters, and events we encounter feel vividly real. Yet, upon waking, we recognize that these experiences were merely projections of our own mind. Similarly, 
The Kybalian posits that the physical world is a kind of collective dream, a manifestation of the universal mind. The objects, forces, and phenomena we perceive are not independent entities, but rather expressions of this underlying mental energy. The convergence of ancient wisdom and modern science is nowhere more evident than in the remarkable alignment between the hermetic law of mentalism and cutting-edge theories in quantum physics. This unexpected intersection illuminates a profound connection between the spiritual and scientific realms, offering a tantalizing glimpse into the nature of reality itself. Quantum entanglement, a cornerstone of quantum mechanics, demonstrates that particles can become inextricably linked, sharing the same fate regardless of distance. This interconnectedness transcends the traditional boundaries of space and time, suggesting a deeper, underlying reality, a unified field of consciousness that permeates the entire universe. This field, often referred to as the quantum field or zero-point field, resonates with the hermetic concept of a universal mind, the source of all creation. This interconnectedness is not confined to the subatomic realm. The observer effect in quantum mechanics reveals that the act of observation can influence the behavior of particles, highlighting the intimate relationship between consciousness and the physical world. Similarly, the placebo effect in medicine demonstrates the power of belief and expectation to affect physiological outcomes. This phenomenon is not limited to medicine. Studies have shown that our thoughts and emotions can influence everything from our personal relationships to our financial success. The law of mentalism takes these concepts a step further, suggesting that our thoughts, beliefs, and attitudes are not merely internal experiences, but potent forces that actively shape the reality we inhabit. This principle extends beyond the realm of abstract philosophy, finding resonance in various spiritual traditions, scientific discoveries, and everyday life experiences. Consider the well-documented placebo effect, in which a patient's belief in a treatment can trigger physiological responses that lead to healing, even when the treatment itself is inert. This demonstrates the power of the mind to influence the body, affirming the hermetic axiom, as above, so below, as within, so without. Similarly, studies in positive psychology have shown that cultivating optimism and gratitude can improve mental and physical well-being, increase resilience, and enhance overall life satisfaction. This underscores the transformative potential of positive thinking, aligning with the law of mentalism's assertion that our thoughts have a direct impact on our reality. This principle finds further validation in spiritual practices that emphasize the power of intention, visualization, and affirmation to manifest desired outcomes. For example, the ancient practice of prayer, common to many religions, often involves focusing the mind on a specific outcome with the belief that divine intervention can bring it to fruition. Meditation, another widely practiced spiritual discipline, involves training the mind to focus and quieten, thereby cultivating greater awareness and inner peace. These practices, while rooted in different traditions, share a common thread with the law of mentalism, the recognition that our thoughts and beliefs have the power to shape our reality. Moreover, the law of mentalism invites us to reconsider our relationship with the universe. By recognizing the interconnectedness of all things, we shift from a paradigm of separation and isolation to one of unity and belonging. The Buddhist concept of dependent origination, which emphasizes the interdependence of all phenomena, echoes this principle. Similarly, the African philosophy of Ubuntu, which translates to I am because we are, highlights the interconnectedness of human existence. This interconnectedness fosters a sense of compassion, empathy, and responsibility towards all living beings as we recognize that our actions and choices have a ripple effect on the whole. Ultimately, 
The law of mentalism offers a transformative vision of reality, a vision where we are not merely passive observers, but active co-creators of our world. By embracing the notion that the universe is a mental construct, we open ourselves up to a realm of infinite possibilities, where our thoughts and intentions have the power to shape our reality and create a brighter future for ourselves and future generations. This empowering perspective is not just a philosophical abstraction, but a practical tool for personal and collective transformation. It reminds us that we have the power to create a world that reflects our highest aspirations, a world of peace, harmony, and abundance. By aligning our thoughts, beliefs, and actions with these noble ideals, we can collectively manifest a reality that is more just, equitable, and sustainable for all. The second law is the law of correspondence, a fundamental principle in hermetic philosophy, unveils a profound interconnectedness that permeates all levels of existence. It posits a mirrored relationship between the macrocosm, the vast expanse of the universe, and the microcosm, the intricate inner world of the individual. This profound mirroring is encapsulated in the hermetic maxim, as above, so below, as within, so without. The macrocosm and microcosm. This principle suggests that the patterns, structures, and principles we observe in the universe are replicated within ourselves and vice versa. Consider the structure of an atom, with its nucleus and orbiting electrons, which bears a striking resemblance to the solar system, with the sun and its planets. This similarity extends beyond mere visual analogy. The atom, like the solar system, is a dynamic system governed by fundamental forces and principles, such as gravity and electromagnetism. In the realm of biology, the fractal nature of many natural forms, from snowflakes to coastlines to the branching patterns of trees, demonstrates this principle of correspondence. Each part reflects the whole, and the whole is contained within each part. This fractal pattern is mirrored in our own bodies, where the structure of our organs and tissues reveals a similar self-similarity at different scales. The interplay of opposites. The law of correspondence is also evident in the dynamic interplay of opposites that characterizes the universe. The ancient Chinese concept of yin and yang encapsulates this principle, illustrating the interconnectedness and interdependence of seemingly opposing forces, light and darkness, masculine and feminine, active and passive. These polarities are not static, but rather, they constantly shift and transform, creating the dynamic flow of life. This principle is reflected in the human psyche as well. Our thoughts and emotions often oscillate between opposing poles, such as joy and sorrow, hope and despair, love and fear. By recognizing and embracing these polarities within ourselves, we can achieve a greater sense of balance and wholeness. Scientific Perspectives The law of correspondence finds resonance in various scientific disciplines. In ecology, the concept of ecosystems highlights the interconnectedness of living organisms and their environment, demonstrating how changes in one part of the system can affect the whole. In systems theory, the concept of feedback loops illustrates how actions and events in one part of a system can trigger a cascade of effects that reverberate throughout the entire system. The emerging field of quantum biology is also revealing surprising connections between the quantum world and the living world. For instance, some scientists speculate that quantum entanglement, a phenomenon where particles remain connected regardless of distance, may play a role in biological processes such as photosynthesis and bird navigation. In essence, the law of correspondence invites us to contemplate the profound interconnectedness that permeates all levels of existence. It challenges us to look beyond surface appearances and recognize the underlying unity that binds us to the cosmos. By understanding and embracing this principle, we can cultivate a deeper sense of connection to ourselves, to others, and to the universe as a whole. This, in turn, 
can lead to a more meaningful, fulfilling, and harmonious life. The Law of Vibration, the Foundation of Universal Harmony The Law of Vibration is a fundamental principle suggesting that everything in the universe, from the smallest subatomic particles to the grandest celestial bodies, exists in a constant state of vibration. Each entity vibrates at a unique frequency, creating a symphony of energies that shape our reality. Understanding Vibrational Frequencies At its core, vibration refers to the oscillating movement of energy. Different rates of vibration manifest as various forms of matter, energy, and consciousness. For instance, physical matter, a rock, a tree, or a human body, all consist of atoms vibrating at specific frequencies. The denser the object, the slower its vibrational frequency. Energy, light, sound, and heat are forms of energy characterized by different wavelengths and frequencies. Higher frequencies correspond to more intense and potent energies. Consciousness, our thoughts, emotions, and beliefs carry distinct vibrational frequencies. Positive emotions like love and joy resonate at higher frequencies, while negative emotions like fear and anger vibrate at lower ones. The Principle of Attraction A key aspect of the law of vibration is the principle of attraction, often summarized as like attracts like. Our vibrational frequencies act as magnets, attracting experiences, people, and circumstances that match our dominant vibration. For example, if we cultivate a high vibrational state through positive thoughts, gratitude, and loving intentions, we are more likely to attract positive experiences and joyful encounters. Conversely, if we dwell in low vibrational states of fear, resentment, or negativity, we may inadvertently draw in challenging situations and conflicts. Aligning with the universe. By consciously working with the law of vibration, we can strive to raise our vibrational frequencies and create more harmonious lives. Some practical ways to do this include mindfulness and meditation. These practices help us become aware of our thoughts and emotions, enabling us to shift our focus towards higher vibrational states. Gratitude. Expressing gratitude for the blessings in our lives elevates our vibrations and attracts more abundance. Positive affirmations. Repeating positive statements reinforces empowering beliefs and raises our vibrational frequencies. Surrounding ourselves with positivity. Engaging in uplifting activities, spending time with positive people, and consuming inspiring content all contribute to raising our vibration. Harmony with the Universe By aligning our vibrations with the universal harmony, we open ourselves to greater possibilities and create a more fulfilling life experience. We become co-creators of our reality, attracting experiences that resonate with our highest aspirations and deepest desires. While the law of vibration may seem abstract, its principles offer practical insights for personal growth and transformation. By understanding and working with our vibrational frequencies, we can unlock our full potential and manifest a life of joy, abundance, and well-being. The Law of Polarity – Embracing the Duality of Existence The Hermetic Law of Polarity delves into the fundamental concept of duality in the universe. It asserts that everything in existence has two seemingly opposite poles, like two sides of a coin. These polarities are not separate entities, but rather different degrees of the same underlying energy or principle. Examples of polarity Temperature Hot and cold are not distinct entities, but varying degrees of temperature. Absolute zero represents one extreme, while the highest possible temperature is the other. Light and darkness Light and darkness are not fundamentally different, but represent varying intensities of light. Complete darkness is the absence of light, while pure light is its highest concentration. Love and hate. Love and hate are emotional states directed towards the same object or person, differing only in degree and expression. Good and evil. 
Good and evil are ethical concepts on a spectrum, with varying shades of morality between them. Masculine and feminine, these represent different expressions of the same creative energy, both essential for balance and wholeness. Understanding Polarity The law of polarity teaches us that these seemingly opposite poles are not separate and distinct but interconnected and interdependent. One cannot exist without the other. For example, without darkness, we would not appreciate light, and without cold, we would not recognize warmth. The illusion of separation. Often, we perceive these polarities as separate and conflicting forces, leading to internal and external conflicts. We tend to judge one pole as good and the other as bad, creating a sense of separation and imbalance. However, the Hermetic teachings emphasize that these opposites are merely different expressions of the same underlying reality. Transmutation through polarity. One of the most powerful applications of the law of polarity is the concept of transmutation, the ability to transform one state into another by shifting the degree of vibration. For example, fear to courage. By understanding the underlying energy of fear and consciously shifting its vibration, we can transform it into courage. Hate to love. Hate, being a lower vibration of love, can be transformed into love by raising its vibrational frequency through forgiveness and understanding. Negative to positive. Negative thoughts and emotions can be transmuted into positive ones by consciously focusing on gratitude, joy, and love. Finding balance. True mastery lies not in suppressing or denying one pole, but in finding the balance point between the two. By embracing both polarities and understanding their interconnectedness, we can achieve a state of harmony and wholeness. This involves recognizing the value and necessity of both light and darkness, both love and hate, and finding the middle path that leads to balance and integration. The law of polarity invites us to explore the dynamic interplay of opposites in our lives and in the universe. By understanding this fundamental principle, we can transcend the illusion of separation, embrace the full spectrum of experience, and achieve greater self-awareness and spiritual growth. The Law of Rhythm – Embracing the Cyclical Nature of Life The Hermetic Law of Rhythm reveals a fundamental truth about the universe. Everything moves in cycles. Just as the pendulum swings back and forth, life itself is a continuous dance of ebb and flow, rise and fall. This universal principle manifests in countless ways, shaping our experiences and offering profound insights into the nature of existence. Examples of Rhythmic Cycles Natural World Seasons, Spring's Growth, Summer's Abundance, Autumn's Harvest, and Winter's Rest form a rhythmic cycle of renewal and change. Tides, the ocean's ebb and flow, Influenced by the moon's gravitational pull, create a predictable rhythm of high and low tides. Day and night, the Earth's rotation creates the rhythmic alternation of daylight and darkness. Planetary movements, the orbits of planets around the sun follow cyclical patterns, marking the passage of time and influencing astrological cycles. Human experience, breath, our most basic bodily function, the inhalation and exhalation of breath follows a continuous rhythm. Heartbeat, the rhythmic pumping of the heart sustains life, reflecting a consistent pattern of contraction and relaxation. Sleep-wake cycle, our bodies naturally follow a circadian rhythm, regulating our sleep and wakefulness patterns. Emotional states, our emotions fluctuate in cycles, from moments of joy and excitement to periods of sadness or introspection. Life stages, birth, growth, maturity, decline, and death form the overarching cycle of life itself. Understanding the Law of Rhythm The Law of Rhythm teaches us that change is a constant in the universe. Nothing remains static, everything fluctuates between polarities. When we understand this principle, we can approach life's challenges with greater equanimity. 
We realize that setbacks and difficulties are not permanent, but rather temporary phases in a larger cycle. Similarly, periods of success and happiness are also transient, reminding us to savor the present moment. Navigating life with equanimity. By recognizing the cyclical nature of life, we can develop resilience and adaptability. We learn to embrace the ups and downs, knowing that each phase has its purpose and lesson. When we encounter challenges, we can draw strength from the knowledge that the pendulum will eventually swing back in our favor. During periods of success, we can remain grounded and humble, understanding that change is inevitable. Applying the Law of Rhythm The law of rhythm can be applied to various aspects of our lives. For example, personal growth. We can use this principle to understand our emotional cycles, identify patterns, and develop strategies for navigating difficult emotions. Relationships By recognizing the natural ebb and flow of relationships, we can cultivate patience, understanding, and compassion. Career we can anticipate and prepare for cyclical changes in the workplace, adapting our approach to maximize opportunities and minimize challenges. Health. By aligning our daily routines with our natural rhythms, we can optimize our physical and mental well-being. The law of rhythm reminds us that life is a dynamic and ever-changing journey. By embracing this fundamental truth, we can cultivate a deeper understanding of ourselves and the world around us, fostering a sense of peace, acceptance, and resilience in the face of life's inevitable fluctuations. The Law of Cause and Effect, the Fabric of Reality's Tapestry. The Hermetic Law of Cause and Effect, a cornerstone of ancient wisdom, reveals a profound truth about the universe. Nothing happens by chance or randomness. Every action, every thought, every event is the result of a specific cause and in turn becomes the cause of subsequent effects. This principle, often referred to as karma in Eastern philosophies, underscores the interconnectedness of all things and the profound impact of our choices. Understanding cause and effect. At its core, the law of cause and effect states that for every effect, there must be a corresponding cause. This relationship is not limited to physical events, but extends to the realms of thought, emotion, and even spirituality. Physical realm, a ball thrown into the air, cause, will inevitably fall back to the ground due to gravity, effect. Mental realm, a thought of anger, cause, can lead to an outburst or rash decision, effect. Emotional realm, an act of kindness, cause, can generate feelings of joy and gratitude in both the giver and receiver, effect. Spiritual realm, engaging in practices like meditation and mindfulness, cause, can lead to greater self-awareness and inner peace, effect. The illusion of chance. While chance and luck may seem to play a role in our lives, the law of cause and effect suggests that these are merely labels we apply to events where the underlying causes are not immediately apparent. With deeper understanding, we can often trace the chain of events that led to a seemingly random occurrence. Active creators of reality. The law of cause and effect empowers us with the understanding that we are not passive victims of circumstance, but active participants in creating our reality. Our thoughts, words, and actions are seeds that we sow, and the harvest we reap is a direct result of the seeds we plant. Thoughts, our thoughts are potent forces that shape our beliefs, attitudes, and ultimately, our actions. By cultivating positive and empowering thoughts, we can create a more positive reality. Words, our words have the power to uplift or tear down, to inspire or discourage. By choosing our words wisely, we can create a more harmonious and supportive environment. Actions. Our actions are the most tangible expression of our thoughts and intentions. By acting with integrity, kindness, and compassion, we contribute to a more just and loving world. Taking responsibility. 
The law of cause and effect also calls us to take responsibility for our lives. We cannot blame external circumstances or other people for our misfortunes. Instead, we must recognize that our current situation is the cumulative result of our past choices. By acknowledging this, we empower ourselves to make conscious decisions and create a more fulfilling future. The ripple effect. Every action we take, no matter how small, sets off a chain reaction of cause and effect. Our choices not only impact our own lives, but also ripple out to affect others and the world around us. By recognizing this interconnectedness, we can make more conscious choices that contribute to the greater good. Embracing the law of cause and effect. By understanding and embracing the law of cause and effect, we can cultivate a sense of empowerment and agency in our lives. We realize that we have the power to shape our destiny through our thoughts, words, and actions. By consciously choosing to align our actions with our highest values and aspirations, we can create a more meaningful and fulfilling life, both for ourselves and for the world we inhabit. The Law of Gender The Dance of Masculine and Feminine Energies the hermetic law of gender transcends the conventional understanding of biological sex and delves into the deeper interplay of energies that permeate all of creation. It posits that everything in the universe embodies both masculine and feminine principles, not as opposing forces, but as complementary aspects of a unified whole. Understanding Masculine and Feminine Energies the masculine and feminine principles are not confined to gender roles or physical attributes. They represent fundamental archetypal energies that manifest in various ways throughout the cosmos. Masculine energy. Active, assertive, outward-focused. Associated with logic, intellect, and willpower. Expressed through action, initiative, and leadership. Represented by the sun, fire, and the sky. Feminine energy. Receptive, nurturing, inward-focused. Associated with intuition, emotion, and creativity. Expressed through receptivity, compassion, and collaboration. Represented by the moon, water, and the earth. Examples of gender expression. The interplay of masculine and feminine energies can be observed in various aspects of life. Nature. The sun's radiant energy, masculine, interacts with the earth's fertile soil, feminine, to create life. Human relationships. A healthy relationship involves a balance of both masculine and feminine energies, with each partner contributing their unique strengths and perspectives. Creative expression. Artistic creation often involves a dance between the masculine energy of inspiration and the feminine energy of manifestation. Spiritual Practices Many spiritual traditions recognize the importance of balancing masculine and feminine energies within oneself to achieve wholeness and enlightenment. The Science and Spirit Connection The law of gender is not just a philosophical concept. It also has scientific underpinnings. In physics, the concept of polarity is fundamental, with positive and negative charges representing two aspects of the same electromagnetic force. Similarly, in biology, the interaction between sperm, masculine, and egg, feminine, is essential for the creation of new life. The spiritual aspect of the law of gender lies in recognizing the divine masculine and divine feminine as complementary aspects of the universal consciousness. By integrating these energies within ourselves, we can achieve a state of inner balance and harmony, leading to greater creativity, compassion, and spiritual growth. Transcending Dualistic Thinking the law of gender invites us to move beyond dualistic thinking that sees masculine and feminine as opposing forces. Instead, it encourages us to embrace the dynamic interplay of these energies, recognizing their inherent value and interconnectedness. By understanding and integrating both masculine and feminine aspects within ourselves, we can tap into our full potential and live more authentic and fulfilling lives. We can cultivate greater self-awareness, 
deepen our relationships, and contribute to a more harmonious and balanced world.